guys hi welcome back to my channel and today we are checking out someone new on my channel and not only someone new but someone new from the country whose artists we have never checked out on my channel previously and it is vietnam yeah this is vietnamese artist and i'm pretty sure i'll be pronouncing his name incorrectly so i apologize in advance but i will learn it for sure so is it a song dung mtp i'm not sure but just let me know in the comment section below and the song name is damn should i even try this is chung ta chua dong lai is it how we are saying it have no idea okay this song was dropped around a week ago and i don't know it just popped up in my uh, youtube recommendations there was one artist who also popped up in my youtube and yeah i, I don't remember it was it nomo or mono uh, and i think i think he's also from vietnam but I don't know why I did not check him out and I have not even listened to the song. But this song, uh, yeah, I just got interested and I was like, Ninja, let's do this. Let's check out someone from Vietnam and here we are. Also, guys, uh, you know that we don't like checking out artists for the first time without double checking their uh, kind of background and all. So I opened up this page and let's read it really, really quickly. First of all, let me see how he looks like he's 29 right yeah he's 29 years old oh uh, he's got he's got a rapper vibe not gonna lie yeah he's got a vibe of a person who, who kind of uh, raps and all <laughs> okay let's see a uh, 29 years old uh, full name yo i don't know Oh, these are the songs. Okay. 2017. He's been active this long. 2017. 20 <gasps> Is it his song as well? 2013? Do choking. Okay, a short info about Anguyen Dang. Dung, known professionally as Son Dung MTP, is a Vietnamese singer, songwriter, and actor born and raised in Taipin, Taipin province. His family discovered his singing ability when he was two years old. Wow, that explains why we are seeing uh, some uh, songs from 2013 and all. Okay, education, hate, parents. Okay, siblings. <gasps> Mono is. <laughs> I'm joking. Is this the one I was talking about? No, I, I was saying no more thing or mono. It is mono. They are siblings. Okay, okay, okay. He also looks like someone who is rapping. I don't know. I don't know what kind of a vibe that is. Uh yeah, they are siblings. You know which song I was talking about? of mono wait let me open it up this one uh open your eyes uh this uh, came up in my youtube recommendations so should we check it out i don't know but let's start with uh Sondung, <laughs> mtp damn they are siblings okay like i'm surprised i'm just surprised because mono was the first one who appeared uh in my youtube bros feed and it is it is so funny that i just mentioned him in the beginning of this video and he actually is us i mean they are actually siblings okay okay guys make sure to subscribe if you want us to check out more vietnamese artists but before all of that let's start with this one Oh, MTP. Is it is it his label? Is it his own label, MTP? But why is it uh, in his name as well? I don't know. Just give me some extra information, please. <laughs> okay. Wow. Did I turn all lyrics? Yeah. 
No one could change the past. <laughs> Not true, honestly. <laughs> That's true. You can you can always rewrite uh, the past, and it has happened a lot in, in the history of so many countries. Even in case of my country, like who knows what actually happened in the past? Because I honestly I do believe that uh, someone who who has higher status um maybe i don't know maybe the parliament in the government and all they are able to push people rewrite the history in the books and once a century pass or just maybe even a couple of years no one will be able to distinguish a truth from lie so i'm sorry but i think you can change the past by rewriting it but you can definitely not change what have actually happened Y'all, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no one could change the past. But someone gotta try. Whoa! Oh, that is new. I like that. Liệu mai sau pha vội mau không bước bên cạnh nhau Thì ta có đâu Time is my first time listening to Vietnamese language I think I mean in a song itself Well it is so kind of fresh for my ears currently Liệu mai sau pha vội mau không bước bên cạnh nhau Thì ta có đâu Đôi mi nhồi pha ai sẽ lau Ai sẽ đến lau nỗi đau này Vô tâm quay lưng ta từ Vậy là thật sự tốt Và không biết nhau He's got this Willan vibe And you know Willow Willans Rồi niềm đau có trong quen I have visuals Về tường lòng xót xa This is so beautifully done. Emotional. But 
done. This is so beautifully done. Eyes on night, you so nice. Ah, this job, what the hell? Are we going to have kind of second part? Well, let me say this. I'm so here for it. Okay, uh, how to put it in the correct way? I'm so happy. My first ever Vietnamese artist reaction was specifically this one. Uh, this Thantung MTP. And specifically this song. I I feel like I'm just so lucky that uh, I, I started digging into Vietnamese music with this specific one because I, I loved it. Like, it's not only that I liked it, no, I absolutely loved it, especially that freaking drop. Wow, there is something with that drop. I don't know, is it instrumentals? Is it uh, sounds voice itself? But... It was wow, it was so good. Like in the first verse, not gonna lie, I was not feeling it fully, but when the drop came in for the second time, I already felt it. I felt it with my whole body and soul. And wow, but him he, this dude, I, I love his voice, but if we talk about visual side, him no, no. in this one with Willan, a vibe and aura damn that is totally my cup of tea you know we love and we adore our villain vibes itself okay okay we're we're sticking we're sticking with him uh i will be kind of staying tuned for second part for the continuation and we will definitely react to it and about the music video it was so beautiful like story itself at all it was it was quite sad and i feel like all these things that uh, he's seeing here she can't see him right so it's like he's going back to the past to change some things um through this door uh and i don't know what is going on here exactly so when they meet like I, I don't know is she from the past is it where she's currently located in have no idea and especially have no idea what we are getting here how he ended up next to her when she actually disappeared so yeah i don't know just give me a bit more of a uh kind of information about the storyline and all but yeah I i'm promising you guys that you're going to check out um that new song he will be dropping i hope he will drop it soon and yeah we are here for it so if you want to check out all of it with me make sure to subscribe for leaving and i'll see you in the next one bye